Hey, health enthusiasts! Have you ever wondered why some people struggle with weight loss despite cutting calories and hitting the gym? The answer might lie in a hormone called insulin. Today, let's dive into how insulin helps fat cells grow and what you can do about it. First off, what is insulin? Insulin is a hormone your body releases when you eat, especially when you consume carbohydrates. Its job is to help cells absorb glucose, sugar, from your bloodstream and convert it into energy. Sounds good, right? But here's the catch. When there's too much glucose, insulin tells your body to store it, not as energy, but as fat. Now think of insulin as the growth factor for fat cells. Every time you eat a carb-heavy meal, insulin surges, directing any excess glucose to be stored in fat cells. This makes those cells expand and grow, leading to increased body fat. When insulin levels are consistently high, your fat cells become more efficient at storing fat. This brings us to the insulin weight loss trap. High insulin levels can create a frustrating cycle of weight gain. More insulin means more fat storage. More fat storage leads to more insulin resistance. As your body becomes resistant to insulin, it needs to produce even more of it to keep blood sugar levels stable. This vicious cycle makes it harder to burn fat and easier to gain weight. But don't worry, breaking this cycle is possible. The key to weight loss isn't just reducing calories, it's managing insulin levels. Here's how one. Cut back on refined carbs. Processed foods, sugary drinks, and white bread cause massive insulin spikes. Opt for whole grains, leafy vegetables, and low-carb alternatives to keep insulin levels in check. 2. Eat healthy fats. Healthy fats like avocado, olive oil, and nuts don't trigger a significant insulin response. Including more of these in your diet helps reduce hunger, keeps your blood sugar stable, and minimizes fat storage. 3. Incorporate intermittent fasting. When you fast, your body has time to lower insulin levels and burn through fat stores for energy. Even short fasting windows like 16, 8, 16 hours fasting, 8 hours eating, can dramatically improve insulin sensitivity. 4. Exercise regularly. Exercise helps your muscles use glucose for energy, reducing the need for insulin. Even moderate activities like walking or strength training can make your body more efficient at managing blood sugar. 5. Limit snacking. Every time you eat, your insulin levels rise. By limiting snacking between meals, you give your body time to burn fat and keep insulin levels low. So, in conclusion, understanding insulin's role in fat storage is a game changer. Rather than focusing solely on cutting calories, managing insulin levels can help you lose weight faster and more efficiently. By controlling insulin, you're not just addressing fat storage but also improving your metabolism, energy levels, and overall health. Next time you're thinking about weight loss, remember, insulin management is key to helping you achieve lasting results. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more health tips. Stay healthy.